They said it did not exist. <laughs> But, as evidence provides, it is very real. Do you like Blue Diamond's design? It's growing on me. Droopy eyes and headscarf fitting for a depressed slash sell-in personality. Amethyst, turn into a chair. I need to sit down. L-E-W-E-D. Jasper isn't even unique in being a giant dick. Worst gem. What kind of gem is Holly? <laughs> this bomb would have been better without Greg. Seriously, he was front and center the last two episodes. The audience. No. But I wasn't even fin- No. Cartoon Network in charge of not leaking everything. Cartoon Network in charge of not ruining everything. Greg is the guy that cucks out the guys. His dick single-handedly destroyed a Garden of Eden. Changed his name, allowed Rose to have other relationships. Doesn't even get to see his own soon. Yeah, he's a real alpha. The male of the year on Return of the Kings. You know damn well if Steven wasn't there Greg would have engaged in a total human zoo fuckfest. Now, he'd get cucked to hell and back. If Steven wasn't there, he'd be jacking off and crying in the corner while people fuck. Okay this Steven bomb has convinced me of three things. With all the natural variation in amethyst size, design and coloration, it's highly likely that Sheena is a rose quartz who looked just human enough to escape. Blue Diamond is best diamond and will be redeemed, which can only happen if diamond swap is true. Pink Diamond didn't swap bodies with Rose, Rose switched bodies with Pink Diamond, forcing her to kill her body to protect Earth. What the fuck are you talking about? How do you leak five whole episodes a month in advance? Honestly, the Crystal Gems are starting to come off as bad guys retelling history in their favor. A society only works if everyone plays their part. I need more Diamond character development, I need more Yellow breaking down as she tries to hide her emotions about Pink. I need more blue seeing humans as interesting curiosities. I need white seeing her fellow diamonds weakness and shattering them in a bid for complete domination of the empire. I honestly can't wait to see just who the fuck white is and why Pearl is so instant on not bringing her up when it's becoming increasingly obvious she was her Pearl. They're from Earth. Wow. Can we take a moment to talk about Amphis' new army? I want to fugue it. Oh no! Oh yes! It's so damn weird seeing what the diamonds consider clothing. Greg be our husbando. No. Fuck everything, love is over, nothing matters. They like to cover their reproductive organs. Really? Well then, just give them a sheet or something. We're already on a tight schedule. Bloop on my fucking wife. Bloop on my fucking wife! Our Greg. Pearl is slowly falling for him. Blue Diamond is the best diamond. I want to hug me some giant blue mom. Has Pearl always been the funniest person on this show? Her jokes were on point this bomb. Corrupted gems invade home world when the crystal gems can teleport them now that they know where home world is exactly. They could bring it all down. That part where Blue Diamond lifts her arm and the big spaceship arms rises out of the clouds. I usually make fun of this show, but that was a pretty fucking old cool scene. Colin, Joe and Rebecca, the fucking dream team. I instantly knew that was going to be an excellent finale. An army has a use, it can go and fight a war. A sapphire has a use, she can tell you what it's for. An agate terrifies, or lapis terraforms. Terraformer lapis confirmed! Imagine Greg's reaction if they're in bubble that whole room. All those roses. All those roses. All those roses. Sucking murder cock dick. She can just fit his entire body in her mouth easily. A ruby, it's a tiny jasper. That's all the episodes for the next few months. I watched them all in one go. Wow, I hate myself. We cry men. Once, I saw a bee drown in honey, and I understood. It is our constant need for fulfillment that is our emotional undoing, anonymous. We will always give in to temptation, in the end. We will have an extra slice of cake knowing it will be bad for us. 
We'll have another glass of beer knowing we have to drive home. And we'll sit through an entire Stephen bomb knowing we'll be starving for more as soon as it's over. That loin cloth is turning into a tent. I need art of this. So, like, they just gotta leave all those humans in there. Who cares? This show is shit. That old lady is pretty sexy. Steven Universe has so many hot mature women. It's great. Skinny Jasper with medium length poofy hair. Connie episodes are actually good. Connie fags are so fucking stupid. Bruh, you think that was fat? My nigga BT has the biggest juiciest ass. That ass got Greg like. Holy shit! Killed by Snoo Snoo. How can they make her so great so consistently? This moment actually made me like Pearl. Do you think Blue Diamond will be a crystal gem? That shit would be cash. What's the use of feeling? Got some good pearls this bomb. You will never be Steven watching Pearl get paddled and degraded by White Diamond. You will never hear her beg for Steven not to look. Months and years later after they've escaped she will occasionally see him looking at her out of the corner of his eye. Knowing he's reliving the entire chain of events that in his mind's eye from start to finish. You will never hear Pearl cry out of mingled arousal, shame and frustration. I liked how all the zoo people were like. They were about to all over Greg's dick. That feel when you will never be crushed by Blue Diamond's thick depressed ass. Why live? Connie you stay here. Lackers and Perry dot you stay here. Put this post in it. <laughs>